Ta-da! I felt like it. So earlier in the video, I was talking about marriage, marriage customs, and the extravagant spending of money in Indian marriages, even when people can't afford it, and how people can't get out of the system even if they want to. These were the things that I was talking about. So what else to say on it? <laughs> mm -hmm. Let's sit here uh, for some time thinking about ideas to talk about. I don't know, I just felt like it. Is this how views go up? Um, do, I like, do I look pretty? I don't want to expose anything. <laughs> Um, I always think that I look prettier without the specs but then I can't see myself I can't see people it's a good thing but still that's not how it is supposed to be one thing that I was thinking was when I'm speaking I have a lot of filler words I use a lot of um so you know and a lot of repetitions happen in my speeches so if I take a conscious effort to correct it even if I'm going a bit slow even if I'm thinking what to speak next I think it's a good practice to avoid the filler words instead of saying um I think it's better to say um I think it's better to do a pause pause and think what to say next or just don't say anything be comfortable with the silence in between don't fill it with sounds like um uh so I'm trying to take a conscious effort. So whenever I say um, I'll try to um, count count it like one, two, etc. Mm. So one thing that I recently started enjoying to do, everything we in the initial stages we find it very enjoyable to do to do. So I have a friend who is living nearby. I'm became friends with this person recently and we usually take strolls in the evening and talk about everything that comes across so today we went for a walk usually I go to her house that is half a kilometer between our houses and I walk till there and when I almost reach there I call her up and she'll come out of the house and there will be a 200 meters distance between both of us when we see each other she'll be in front of her house where the gate is and I'll be walking towards her house so she sees me I see her we are facing each other with a distance of 200 meters and I look at her she looks at me we smile at each other thinking that we both can see the smile I can't spot that smile on her face because my vision is not that clear I think she feels the same but I think we do both smile and we slowly walk and it's 180 meters of distance between us and suddenly I don't know where to look should I look at her and smile again should I look at this side and maybe enjoy the view and again after two seconds look at her back and see how much distance we have between each other and should I smile again or should I look at this side I don't know if these things are going through her mind but I'm like okay every time I'm coming closer she's also coming closer and when the distance uh, it takes maybe half a minute to uh, join so in between that the half minute I have in between I keep thinking should I look at her and smile again I smile at her almost two or three times and then um, it's definitely awkward to smile the whole time the whole of 30 seconds if we are smiling and looking at each other it's awkward so I was thinking about these instances what do people do at these times so what I do is I look beside that side and I'm thinking about the smile and I'm not even seeing what's around I'm looking here and there yeah the sky is nice mm, the canal is dry oh the dog is sleeping maybe something's cross my mind but underneath of it what I'm thinking is should I look at her back again and smile okay so if I talk about marriages and the custom and what all things I disapprove in it I don't think um, it's the right video to speak about that 
so i'll close it here thank you for listening abin joseph because he's the only listener i have he sees my videos so if you finish my video till the fifth minute i have a shout out for you here so hi abin joseph i'm glad that you're listening to my videos you're my only listener and i hope nobody else listens okay bye see you on another episode of ranting or ranting therapy or talking about marriages or anything around the world bye